Hello everybody and welcome to Clear Plays The Sims 3. Uh, yes, this is actually not what I was intending to play. Um, I was actually intending to play The Sims 2. However, I'm actually having a serious issue with uh, The Sims 2 and how it renders and stuff. Um, and I'm a bit confused as to why the water in this game is not doing what it's supposed to do. Uh, suffice to say, at the moment, this game looks a bit like a piece of poo. Okay, um, I've chosen a town and I'm going to create a sim and we're going to put them in and we're probably going to torture them a bit. Just a bit, you know, not a lot. Um, but actually, I'm gonna decide, I've decided it's pretty much going to be up to you guys what I do with them. Um, so yeah, let's actually start creating a sim. Okay, create a sim slider. I'm thinking... Uh, girl? Dag dag. But, mm, the, the one thing that The Sims has, it does actually have like weight sliders and stuff and you can just go... Oh, that lovely floor. little girl there. Um, we're gonna call our character uh, Captain Tubbs. And if you um, have ever, you know, uh, seen seen some of my games before, Captain Tubbs is kind of a thing. In fact, Captain Tubbs. Um, can, can be a middle of the road kind of guy with ridiculous muscles yeah and really high muscle definition and 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 tiny boobies um, we're going to make her hair oh what's oh I have several inspection expansion packs installed um, I don't have pets I don't have supernatural I have them, but I haven't installed them because because maybe if, if everybody wants particular things from those packs, then then we'll do. Oh, what's the most ridiculous hairstyle we can? Wow, most ridiculous hairstyle. I am assuming this is the Into the Future pack. I don't have the Island Paradise one either. Um, that these are pretty ridiculous. Um, wow. Oh, that's kind of. 50s and we got a faux hawk mm. so what are the hats like let's have a look at the hats oh there's an alien mask is it gone is the music gone i think it is for the moment anyway right so i've got a feeling that what we should probably do is we should probably make the worst looking sim that we can possibly find okay so person on drugs like really really drugified um i can actually probably do the do the slidery bits oh no i don't particularly want to go oh my god what's going on there okay so weird eyes uh what can i do this one eyelid height oh my god wide staring eyes uh she, she looks vaguely like she's on drugs so <laughs> if you look at this She's just like, oh man, I'm on drugs. Dude, I'm so high. Oh, oh my God. Yeah, let's go for, dude, I'm on drugs. Um, eyebrow height, eyebrow curve. Does that do anything? I'm really, really surprised. Yeah, she's got really surprised face, nose, nose. Um, in fact, let's pick a random, that's a, not a, I don't really want to be rude about people's noses in case you have one of these noses. Okay, that's the nose we're going for. Um, bridge height. Yep, there we go. Uh, Jeez. Well, let's see if we can breed the ugly out of this game. Um, lips width, height, yeah there we go, uh, let's give her freckles, let's give her lots of freckles, because um, if this person can find love then everyone can, okay, now that's some makeup, that's some real makeup, 
Oh my god, what are we doing? Uh, no, I think I think this this maybe this one. This style of makeup in th those colours. There you go. Oh, and she should probably have a tattoo. Um, Salaba Wifa. Uh, I guess she's having it on her back then. Um, what do we want on her back? Um, a llama? Is that how big you can make them? Kind of want the llama. Eh. She's got a llama tattoo on her back. Right. It's... Oh, hang on. Let's do... Um, Pre Nufa skin color. Yes, yeah, basics. Uh, select skin tone. Are we going to have a green? Oh, here we go. Here's the body tone modifiers. So s slightly radioactive, very radioactive, glowing. Um, I'm kind of very fond of. I'm kind of fond of really sickly radioactive. There you go. That that's that's our character. Now it's just clothes. Um I I hate picking clothes, so I just tend to go for like ridiculous outfits. That that's fairly ridiculous. Um we can do better. We can do better. Particularly if we've got the the future mods installed. That's that's not shabby. Um, we could make her a giant hot dog. Hmm, kind of liking the giant hot dog or the crazy person gloves. Oh, there's a there's the artist kit. Hmm. I'm thinking probably. Well, let's make her not completely unhinged, but let's give her a weird dress. There you go, weird dress in bad colours, and I don't really care about the rest because you hardly ever see them. Um, outerwear, I do kind of like... Um, Snar, kushla. Okay, most horriblest coat ever. Uh... That one. Mm. No, wait, mm. that one. <laughs> okay, character traits. This is the most important part. So we're going to add some traits. Or we could leave her as a blank slate. But that's no fun. Okay, I am going to pick... I'm just going to... Bot fan. Sims... A boom in bot technology has left many Sims fascinated and intrigued by these complex machines. Some would prefer to be a bot. Okay, uh, don't care about that one. Let's go for... Well, we're trying to breed out the, the, the not too attractive and possibly the skin colour as well. So, yeah, she's going to have a baby. Well, let's go with the, the ever, ever wonderful <laughs> evil <laughs> trait. Uh, and I think... Doo -doo -doo. Uh... <laughs> No sense of humour. I love how that's the, how they animate no sense of humour. Let's give her... Oh, I, I, I... Yeah, let's give her unstable. Unstable is always oh. fun. Shame, uh, Basically, they have yeah. nervous breakdowns all the time and then their, then their ch character traits change. So that's always a fun one to do. Um... Do, 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 do. No, we're not going to do. Uh, I think I think no sense of humour and vegetarian is possibly uh, a misnomer. To be honest, um, let's go for neurotic. Oh, and kleptomaniac. There you go. <laughs> okay, what what are our lifetime wishes? Possession is nine tenths of the law. Okay, we could possess 50,000 worth of stolen goods, criminal mastermind, emperor of evil, hang on, so that's the thief branch, criminal branch, lots of money, or gold digger. 
let's go for you see that's going to be really difficult if our character traits change but i think our lifetime which should probably be emperor of evil what's her favorite food her favorite food is falafel and her favorite kind of music is egyptian and her favorite color is they don't have a puke green so let's go for brown because she's evil yet boring okay and her star sign is scorpio apparently okay so captain tubbs let's put her in a village Rafia. right we need to find somewhere for her to live now there are the thing about this is if you live closer to town you can get to your job faster i don't know what job i'm gonna have her make it have her do at the moment or what job you're gonna have her do um well, I suppose she's got to be the Emperor of Evil. But that doesn't mean she actually has to stay that way. I don't really care for about fulfilling lifetime wishes. Um, we could put her in the, the, the Bayou Gulch. Oh, that sounds horrible. There, let's put the... Where's the most miserable place we can make them live? Uh, sure, let's have that house. We can always move her out and, and let's start playing. This is possibly, possibly, the worst house I have ever seen in this game. I like it. I appreciate it. Oh, she wants to join the criminal career. Well, I suppose we can start with that. Um, because she's got to have money somewhere. Okay, let's 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 go down. Let's see what's in it. Wow. Um, I tend to play with walls down so you can see everything. That is, I think the word we're looking for is hole. Um, let's buy, buy her stuff because she's got like money. Let's get her a decent bed. Sweet escape dream pod. Well, no, that sounds entirely too fancy. <laughs> let's get her. Let's get her a really comfortable bunk bed. I don't know why bunk bed because I don't know. Someone's gonna have to sleep around over at some point. Um, I don't care about fire particularly, um, but she needs something to entertain herself. So living room, I guess TV. Um, have your bog standard average TV and a sofa so you can do stuff. In fact, let's have this weird park bench type affair um, because that's legit okay so the very first thing we're going to have a do is hang on what's this feeling calm okay hang on let's play normally right so we've got okay right she wants to learn fishing and to become a criminal um, actually let's go to the, the town where can she join the criminal career path you can see it's usually one of these red ones and that's the police that's the opposite of what she wants to do there so we're going to join criminal career at the what is it llama corp shipping company oh she's got a she's got a llama thing as well off you pop go on run run there you go oh wow that's that's loading in Mysterious portal has appeared in the world. What effects may this have? Except career. Oh, this is the um, this is the Back to the Future stuff. No, Into the Future stuff. That's the same thing. Okay, sh she needs to be athletic to be a criminal. So um, let's set her to work out. I think let's do strength to keep up her impressive muscles. Travel to the future? No. Um, in fact, what we're going to do is we're, we are going to put the captain's portal somewhere out the back so we don't have to deal with it. I don't want to play with this at the moment. Go away. They'll play with it if they want to. Okay, so she's doing her business and oh, she, she has the mood to freak out. Okay, that's fine. What's around town that we can make her do? Clean something. 
What? Buy a washing machine. How much do you smell? Okay, we'll leave it. We'll leave it to do that. And let's go and have a look around town about what we can make her do. Hmm. We could send a dumpster diving, which is always fun. Or we could go. We could send her over here. Let's send her over here. Okay, go here. Come on, go here. And we'll see if we can get her to steal something. Okay. Kleptomania. No? If we if we leave her here long enough, will she just nick things? Oh, have a freak out whilst we're here. That's it? That's all you freak out about? Okay. Uh, let's go and... Hmm. Go to the park and torment people. Go here. Let's see if we can steal candy from a baby. Right. Let's 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 be horrible to someone. You. I have Dilly something. Dilly pigeon. Uh, rude introduction. Go. Go on. Eat her face. Yeah. Yeah, we don't like you. Uh, friendly. Fight! Declare Dilly... <laughs> yell at her first, and then declare her a nemesis. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Dilly's horrible. Uh, fight! Yeah, that's go! Come on, Captain. Yeah, you oh, kicked her ass. Oh. And slap her. <laughs> and evil. Mastermind plot. I don't think that's going to work. We're not friends. Lab Traba. Fiddle. Horrible. No, for that horrible thing, we're going to have another fight. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Dilly's horrible. We don't like Dilly. Let's have dinner. Hot dogs. That she pulled out of her anus. There are anus dogs. Yes. Come on. Did we actually get that skill point? We do not have any skills. I am nuts to it. Doesn't really matter, to be honest. Basically, what we're going to do is we're going to go through her lifetime. Yes, yes, that's what happens if you have no skill. Eat. Eat the hot dogs. Eat the hot dogs that have randomly spawned on this plate. Sorry, I have a habit of run, um, speeding stuff up through the boring stuff. Okay, time to go for a pee. Uh, yes. Have a wee. Go. And then we should probably go home and you should probably go to sleep because you've got work in the morning, I think. Yeah, I think. Yeah, go home. Come on, Captain, go home. We'll find out where Dilly lives later, and then, and then, and then. Yeah, evil slumber, go. So at this point, you need another sim in the house, so you don't have to worry too much about what's going on um, with the one sim in your home. Oh, there's fireflies. Yeah, we live in the, the not the pleasant part of town. We'll send a dumpster diving at some point. Ooh, look at the sparkly sparkly. The sparkly sparkly. Okay, what else have we got in this lovely town? Whoa. I think that would be a game crashing bug. Oh no, whatever that was, I think that's Fraps. I've never had that happen before, but Fraps is apparently going, what, I don't, I don't, I, what, what do you want? What do you want? Hmm. What's this? That's the military base. There's a festival? Is there a summer festival? I don't know if there's a summer festival. But it says visit it if you if you scroll out on the map. Visit town centre summer festival. Well, it's not there yet, so probably not a good idea. Oh, now it's there. Oh, Captain. Oh, 
right, so the summer festival is there. Right, Captain, get out of bed uh, and have quick meal, fe a fiendish quick meal. Yeah, have some cereal. And how neurotic are you that you need to make the Yeah, go to work. Go to work. Let's see what happens on your first day. Would you please go to work? Thank you. Business as usual. What do we want to do? We want her to meet accomplices. There you go. And then she can pay her bills. Donate to Undermine Geese Unlimited. Donate to Undermine World Peace. Um, let's Undermine World Peace. And make her feel good about undermining world peace. Okay, what else can we make her do? <laughs> we could have a if if you really wanted to, guys. We could also have a do one of the other um, professions, like make her a ghost hunter or something. We've met Dennis Racket at work. That's that's never good. Okay, come on. Meet your accomplices and then... Who's Dennis Rackett? Let's have a look, see what he looks like. <laughs> Dennis Rackett. He's he's a moderately attractive man. And who's your boss? Simbad Rotter. You know what? We could totally, totally make her marry one of these two. I kind of like the idea of Simbad Rotter. <laughs> Just because... But they're, they're both fairly attractive blokes and we could possibly breed out the ugly. Um, but it's, but it's, you know, it's a thing. Okay. What's with her hair? You look very posh for, for, oh, is that your work clothes? Okay, go, go have a shower. Take an evil shower. A impending episode. Something feels wrong with the universe and Captain is agitated. She needs to deep, breathe deep or seek professional help from being unstable. Fiendishly delighted. I love the moodlets for evil people. Um, you want to clean something. Uh, clean up. There you go. Go to a dive bar. Hmm? We could go to a dive bar. Or we could make you work out for your job. Hmm. Okay. What do you guys want her to do? Is the question, I think, ultimately. Um, and she can... She can do a cardio workout today. Oh god. Captain Tubbs is experiencing a person personality swap from being delusional. She no longer has the following traits. No sense of human neurotic. She now has the following traits, flirty and mooch. If you don't doesn't go to hospital soon, the new traits will become permanent. I don't think we need to, to worry about that. Be admitted for instability. Uh you know what? No, that's fine. We're good. We're just gonna make her work out like really, really hard. Hey, and then she can go jogging later. And she's gonna have a fiendish meal of soup. Okay. Now, what we're going to do today is I'm going to leave it to you about what you want Captain Tubbs to do. And the funniest things, um, or the most popular things, maybe. I haven't decided yet, but either of those. Those are what we're going to do. So leave your suggestions in the comments. And from me and Cat and Tubbs, mm. Mm. Who, is, who is enjoying her soup, that she made herself, obviously. Class dismissed. <laughs>